Welcome, Taurus. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm back, guys. How are y'all doing? I hope everybody doing is doing fine. Y'all let me know what's going on in your city during the quarantine. Quarantine, right? Ugh. I've been trying my hardest to stay in, you know. But it's kind of, you know. I mean, I'm, all, I'm often in. But, you know, still have to go out, grocery shop, grab what you can grab. You know, it's crazy now. I've been making sure that I've been staying staged up. <laughs> y'all might need to get y'all some, uh, you know, um, some protection candles. To keep your family protected. You know, all that good stuff, you know. If you are new to my channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you're new, if you've been here with me before, welcome back, guys. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. So, I want to let you guys know that I am still currently running a special, guys. I'm going to continue to run the special through April. All right, and we'll see where it goes for the month of May, okay? I'm trying to help as many people as I can with personal readings, okay? Currently, the special is $44.44. You're going to get a full detailed reading as well as you get a free bonus question. The only catch to the bonus question is that it is going to have to be a yes or no question because I am going to utilize the pendulum to get your answer okay so the first question you can ask whatever question you want and then you can answer a question a follow-up question and it has to be a yes or a no question okay because i will utilize the pendulum, pendulum to answer it all right that is going to be 44 dollars and 44 cents originally priced at 67 dollars guys so go ahead and book now i only do a certain amount of readings per day so go ahead and book, guys. That information is going to be in the drop box. And you can also check the comment section um, for the information as well. All right. So now that we got that out the way, guys, let's get into it. Let's see. This is a timeless reading, guys. So whenever you're meant to see it is when you're meant to see it. But I am doing it currently in the month of April. All right. Which is... Coming around close to you guys on birthday. All right, let's see. What message is there for my Taurus? What message do you have for Taurus? Y'all see my little cards? I love these. This um, is the Island Time Wellness Love Oracle cards. I love these. I just got these in, and I've been I've been <laughs> using them ever since I got them. I actually really love this little small. They're small, but they're they got a you know a strong punch to them all right let's see taurus what message is there for taurus y'all hit the like button i just got a feeling this is about to be real, real juicy all right let's see taurus what message is there for taurus woo, 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 woo. i got a photograph Looking at your photos, missing you, nostalgia. Hmm. We got somebody chasing after you. We got the chaser here. Or are you chasing after someone? Let's see. Give me one more card. There we go. Well, I just saw it. Where is it? There we go. The mirror, <laughs> mirroring each other, self-image, all right? Relationships reflect our wounds, stabbed in the back, healing heart. Hmm, interesting. Let's see, why is photograph here? Love call. Okay, so you're definitely watching someone. We got watching, looking, stalking, perception. You're looking at somebody's picture, maybe on Facebook or Instagram. 
Did you give them, put a heart on someone's picture? Someone expresses love, a message of love, thinking of you and letting you know. Okay, so this was past energy. Okay, so I'm getting, you were watching, you're keeping your eye on somebody. You saw somebody's picture and you hearted it, you liked it. Why is the chaser here? Healthy decisions. Hmm. Okay. Why is healthy choices here? Are you trying to decide on whether or not to pursue this person? Did this person heart your picture or show your picture some attention? And you're trying to decide on whether to, to give this person twin flame. Hmm. You got a connection with this person. So this may be someone that you know already. This I don't feel like this is someone new. Why is mirror here? Y'all are mirroring each other. So maybe when one person likes something, the other person goes and like it. If they say something, comment. And you say a comment, you put a comment. Why is mirror here? It's like mirroring each other's energy. Like your goal, you'll go as far as they go. Like if they chase you a little bit, then you may chase a little bit. Because I feel like the flame between you guys is kind of hot right now. Okay, does it not want to come out? There we go. Sunglasses, again. Yeah. You are watching somebody and you're mirroring them. Or they're mirroring you. But I feel like this is your energy. I'm getting like... <laughs> There's some type of copycat energy here, like... Y'all are marrying each other. Or something to that nature. Yeah, that's what I'm getting. Okay, let's get a read. Let's see. Let's see what's what. Give me a past, present, and future energy for my Taurus. The message is there for Taurus. Give me a past energy. Okay. For some of you, this can be an earth sign, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, a fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, or a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. I feel like somebody, you may feel like somebody's going to regret something that they did in the future. Okay. Um, why is the three of pentacles here? This could be, yeah, you guys could have, if you guys are still um, like an essential worker during this pandemic, someone could be, there could be issues at work. Like somebody could possibly be like jealous of you at work. Why is the Five of Swords here? Yeah, Knight of Swords. Somebody is playing around at work. Okay, this could be somebody that you work with. You play around with them sometimes. Okay, y'all work together. And you just joke around. You play with them sometimes. Like you, It's just like a, a, a boyfriend, girlfriend thing at work. A, a work husband, a, something like that. Okay, why is the Ten of Wands here in the reverse? Oh, 
Okay, so this was... Okay, so a lot of you may be um, taking a break or a, a, there's a break period. So maybe some some people are getting laid off. I feel like this has to do with work, okay? Somebody that you work with. Or a lot of you, I think this is like dealing with people that you work with. Why is the four swords here? Yeah, you, you, you like, some of you possibly deal with things that you have to lift. You got to be really... It's taking a, a toll on you, okay? Um, the workload is heavy, and I feel like you guys are possibly now, a lot of you guys possibly are now on a break period from work, like a layoff, okay? Why is the Queen of Cups here? Yeah, there's something here about a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio um, that may be worrying you. Why is the Two of Wands here? There's something here on your mind. Something here is worrying you a little bit. You're possibly like thinking about the future, okay? I feel like a lot of you guys um, are worried about some, some, you know, just where this is going to go. Where, where's this? What's, what's lot? What lies ahead? Your intuition may be telling you um, that somebody wants some type of justice. You can be dealing with a Libra. But I'm getting like, this is social media because it's like you're waiting for somebody to comment. Why, why is it not? Why is it not a cups? Yeah, I'm getting like waiting on a comment, waiting for somebody to comment or somebody to say something. Waiting for this person to respond. So you can, you know, defend yourself. I'm getting like negative people at work or people that you work with. Um, or for some of you, if it is a work related, this is like via social media. Because I got the three of cups here in the reverse. Why is the three of cups here in the reverse? Something about somebody being recognized, somebody getting a lot of attention for something. And I feel like you just watching in the background. Like you just, you watching in the background. Like, and you just waiting, to, you're looking at the responses. And I feel like you want to say something, but your intuition may be telling you to wait. Your intuition is telling you to wait. Hmm. Hmm. Ah. I'm so ready to get my nails done, y'all. Look at what happened to my nail. It's burnt at the end. <laughs> I'm so ready to go get my nails done. This is ridiculous. Like, I think I'm going to learn how to do... Take this time to learn how to do my own nails. Because this is so ugly. <laughs> Alright, let's see. What message is there for my Taurus? Star mother. How can you mother yourself? Okay, the situation could have something to do with a mother or a mother figure or someone's mother or baby mother. Something to, you know, in that form, okay? The great gathering is all coming together. Huh. Give me one more card. Something about coming together. Soul family. Okay. Something about coming together. I'm getting like a mother and her family coming together. Okay. Get grounded. Empaths. Highly sensitive. Connect with nature. Okay. Trust your path. If you knew you would be supported, what would you do? Hmm. Give me one more card, of course. Oh, they gave me two. <laughs> Let's see. Keepers of the earth, you are not alone. Ancient ancestors stand beside you in double mission. 
channeling and uplifting humanity. Inner temple, devotion, tune into the portal of your heart. I feel like this has something to do with coming together with somebody, like a group being social, and there's like a discussion. Like I'm getting like some type of discussion, some type of get together where something is discussed, okay? It could be in regards to work or something to that nature, but I'm getting like a, a group of people. Like I'm getting like a group, a community. What advice do you have for my tours? What advice do you have for Taurus? Okay, we got weight. I kind of figured that was going to come out. I kind of figured. Okay, wait to end the near future. But I kind of figured that weight was going to come out. Yes, okay. Why is weight here? Ask your angels. Okay, so some of you are going to take the time. The best thing to do is to take the time and wait, you know, Wait it out, ask your angels, pray about it, meditate on it before you make a move. In the near future. Why is in the near future here? If you believe, there could be big, happy changes. I feel like some things need to be reconsidered here as well. Okay? And I feel like the ball is in your court. It's up to you. You're going to have to listen to your intuition. You're going to have to trust yourself, okay? Success is right around the corner, okay? And I feel like if you're worried about whether you're going to recover from something, yes, you will recover, okay? Yes, why is yes here? Meditation brings answers. Something is not the right time, okay? And that's something that you need to meditate on or think about before you make a move towards it. Right now is not the right time. See, no, not the right time. And you also have perfect timing, okay? So it's going to be good for you to plan this and not just shoot forward or go towards this situation or um, rush towards something. It's something about the right time, okay? Something right now or in the near, near future is not the right time, okay, to say yes. Something that needs to be meditated on. So it's something about not being so quick to answer or be so quick to give someone an answer or be so quick to comment on it. Um, just kind of sit back and listen to your intuition. If your intuition is telling you to wait, then you should wait, okay, then you should wait. Why is weight here? Ten of Pentacles. This could be involving, you know, in regards to your finances, or a long-term relationship, a marriage, or a family. Why is Ten of Pentacles here? Yeah, this I'm getting the Empress. For some of you, this is about someone's um, mother or a baby mother or just... I'm getting like a mother and family, okay? I'm getting like a family. For a lot of you guys, this could be coming together with family on your mind, okay? Why is ask your angels? Seven of wands, yeah. It's in the reverse. I feel like you may feel like people are against you. We got the queen of cups and the three of cups again. Maybe you feel like this person is against you, okay? Why is the seven of wands reverse? Eight of wands, something that this person said, king of cups, okay? Why is the eight of wands here in the reverse? Yeah, five of cups. Sometimes, sometimes we got the queen of cups, okay? Again, you could definitely be dealing with the Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or you're really, really dealing with your emotions right now. I feel like there's some regrets about something that someone said, okay? So you're going, I feel like you're going to pray about it. You're going to think you're thinking about it, okay? And I feel like for a lot of you, this could have something to do with like family and aunt. Um, a mother, a mother figure, um, something in that nature. With the empress being in the reverse, this is someone not feeling very abundant, someone not being filled, you know, not, not totally 100% in their most feminine energy, okay? In the near future, what do we have? Why do we have in the near future here? Judgment. Okay, so there's a wake-up call, and there is a chance to redeem 
okay? And like I said, somebody is most definitely spying, okay? And like I said, this could be a family event. This could happen at a family event. This could happen at home. This could be involving family or some type of community where people are coming together, okay? Someone's trying to move on from it. I feel like you're trying to move past that. Um, you may feel like this person is still stuck on that. Um, you may feel like this person may be telling your family business. Why is judgment card here? Six of Wands. You may feel like this person wants attention and they're being negative. Okay? And they may be crazy. You may feel like this person is crazy. <laughs> All right. Let's see if you believe. If you believe. Two of Cups and the Knight of Wands. What is this? What is this? Okay, we have the father card. I'm definitely feeling like for a lot of you, there could be like issues in regards to um, mother and father or someone who takes on this type of energy. Could be dealing with an Aries, but I got the mother card and the father card here and they're both in the reverse. So I'm feeling like it could be definitely of, of something at home, okay? Something about a, a why is the Knight of Wands here? Something about somebody being tricky, somebody being sneaky. Okay, somebody believes that someone is sneaky. Okay, you may feel like this person may be throwing shots. Okay, why is yes here? Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn's energy. Why is the Knight of Pentacles here? Ten of Swords. Okay, King of Pentacles. Definitely some of you may be dealing with the Capricorn, um, Virgo, or Taurus. I got Queen of Pentacles here as well. Four of Cups. Do you feel betrayed by this person? You feel stabbed in the back? Do you feel like... Someone doesn't have anything to offer? Why's the King of Pentacles here? The moon in the reverse. There's secrets, okay? There's secrets here. Why's the moon in the reverse? Temperance. Hmm. Sagittarius. Sagittarius's energy could be dealing with the Sagittarius, but I'm getting like a there's a piece of the story that may be missing here. Why is temperance here? Yeah, nine of wands in the reverse. There's someone hiding something. It's like yes. I may have flaws. Because I feel like someone is hiding something here. Why is meditation brings answers? Meditation brings answers. Ten of Cups. Yeah. Okay, so I do. And then the Sun card. Yes. I do feel like um, there needs to be like a, a deep healing here. I do feel like there needs to be like a, a moment of reflection here. Um because I feel like the goal is to get back to this Ten of Cups energy and the Sun card energy, which is the most positive card in the deck. But I feel like there's something here. Somebody has said something that is, has made you feel uneasy. Why is the Ten of Cups here? Something about working on your relationship with this person or work happy. Some of you guys may be happy to go back to work, happy when you go back to work. Um, but I'm just getting like there needs there's something that needs to be worked on. And I feel like maybe you're uncertain how to fix something here. I feel like something needs to be fixed. That's what I'm getting. 
And I feel like a lot of you guys are going to be going within and, and really reflecting and thinking about things. Something, so I feel like somebody triggered you is what I'm getting right. There's a trigger here. Something that you saw or something that was said triggered you, okay? That's what I'm getting. You guys let me know what's going on in the comment section below. All right, and I'll chat with y'all later. Ciao.